Hey guys, welcome to a brand new episode of Pokemon Duels. Today we're going to be opening 300 sextuple. I had to pay for it. I've earned these gems, and I'm going to get my guaranteed. I'm not. I'm not buying the quads. I want a guaranteed EX if I can. There's not. I don't think there's any that I actually need in the pack. But some duplicates that I would quite like to put into. Um, that's the quad. That I'd quite like to put into my already figures. Zapdos being the main one. Is my Zapdos already strong enough? But 104. No, it's not special, right? What can we get? We can have oh Zekrom's in there, so I definitely want Zekrom, so I can have the rest of that deck. Torterra would be cool to get, um, just to have him in my deck. Blastoise, I don't have Blastoise, which is crazy. Um, and Zapdos and Heatran, Heatran as well. So there are some that I could hopefully pull, and I've got guaranteed EX, guaranteed EX. So. And also I just want to talk about something related to boosters in a minute and something I've got planned for uh, my next Pokemon Duel video which I need your comments to stay tuned for all that. Okay, right, the sex double, let's do it. 300 gems, the best thing is it's also going to give me 300 material too which will get me 400 away from uh, getting that enough to buy anything I want. I've not been like wowed by these figures, these new figures in this banner. Uh, I haven't, I haven't used any of them in the, the 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 recent gym, and I've been doing just fine. So first off, we've got a. This is the EX. Come on, come on. Heat the uh, Metagross. I can put him into another Metagross. Metagross has his his. I mean, like unique ability spins. There could be another spinner where he would be awesome. Oh no. <laughs> Just kill the excitement. <laughs> two EXs though. I cannot be complaining about that. Two EXs. I've got an intox a, a attack Deoxys, which means this is good because I I only have one, so that makes two, which means I can run the double Deoxys in a Deoxys squad if I ever come around to do that. In Psychic Gym again, that would be pretty pretty boss. Uh, Metagross as well in there. So again, useful, useful, looking pretty good for a Psychic Gym. Here, yeah. uh, Metagross on a 2 MP, Attack Deoxys on 3 MP. Yeah, so not too bad. Just wanted Zapdos. A new figure. We might. How long have we got left on these? When do they end? Uh, doesn't say. Probably says in the. Am I gonna get 300 gems realistically by then? Um, am I gonna purchase them? Just no. Uh, I've been having real just. Let's get to it, let's get into it. So basically, here's my problem with the game currently. I feel there are a lot of, there's a lot of negativity from a lot of people. And when that's happening and you see it again and again and again, it's like there is, I like, see sometimes I'll just have days when I'm thinking, this is ridiculous, these, these boosters aren't giving me anything and that's not great. But then when I hear it back from everybody else, I just feel like the game is starting to spoil because of it. And so here's what I want to do. I want to do a video of what changes would you make to make this game to to take it forward. It's already. I think it's got just a great groundwork. It's a great strategy game. It's very different. It has a lot of a big skill element to it. It's not just random chance. You can play tactically well. You, somebody could run the same squad, and if you play it in a certain way, you can beat them. If you play, you know, efficiently use your plates well as well as well in combination. So I feel like there's so many changes they could make to make it great. And with the fact that, you know, if we think about the figures that have come out, there have been no, all the figures that we knew were gonna come out, Darkrai, Feraligator now, uh, Rhyperia, all the ones which we knew from the material exchange. So way back two months ago, you could click on Ride On, and it would have the figure right period, even before it came out. So we knew that was coming. But if we take, I don't know, for example, if we took Voltorb, and Electrode isn't there. If we take Poliwhirl, we have no, um, we have no Politoed or Polyrath. So. They it, it doesn't look like they have those figures built yet and I'm really curious as to see what will be the next banner because for alligator was the last one that we were, we were looking for and 
I, yeah, I just want your thoughts on what they could change. Because this, this Rainbow Booster, and, and uh, hopefully it doesn't prove me wrong. Well, I actually mind if it does. But it's a Rainbow Booster, and I'm going to get a rare. And I know that the probably the chances of me getting a rare are so high now compared to what they were. They have changed. And we've seen a devalue in, in the gems, really, because... You buy gems. When I bought gems at the start, I put them into quads. Now quads have not changed, despite some people have been like, they've definitely changed it. They cannot change. They've placed the odds of what you can get, the EXs, what the rate that they drop at. And if they were to change that, then that would fall into illegal practice because you're selling something at a certain value and you would be, you know, the, the quads are specifically for the gems and they're a currency that you buy at a rate and if they change that it would be you know it would be illegal within the game if people are buying money i think uh the the, the kind of gray area is the things like timed boosters and also the gyms so if i buy that that gold booster now 105 gems if i bought it at the beginning of the game i can guarantee that you know i open five of them one of them will be an ex now you could open them for days and you won't get anything better than an uncommon. It's very rare that you'll get a rare. And they, you know, it's not just me thinking, having the bad luck. You know, you can flip a coin and try to get tails and you can get 10 heads in a row. Sometimes bad things, bad people get the bad luck of side of things. But when all of you are saying it, I'm thinking, okay, they definitely dropped the rates. You know, there was a huge shift in gyms and what they were giving out in the 11 consecutive boosters. I did a gym where I got 12 consecutive boosters, 12 times, and I got 10 EXs. Almost 100% return. Now, I hear people running five times through it, I run five times through it, and I've got nothing. I've been opening the single boosters because I don't feel it's now worth the currency of, of putting those gems into, which I did, by the way, which angrily angers me a little bit that I was given a kind of false sense of I buy all these gems and I'm going to make sure I always get to a 12 consecutive streak, even though it's going to cost me 50, 100 gems to continue and, and up my energy boost. And then they drop the rates. That's that's bordering on, you know, it's grey area, I imagine, probably in legalities, but it's 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 bordering on uh just just it's just it's just kind of dirty and uh, i don't like it i think it's it spoils the game and i hear it spoiling for a lot of people more commons lovely so i want your thoughts guys uh sorry for the rant but i just want your thoughts on what would make this game better in the future i've had some great ideas by you guys already i see on twitter people commenting about how if you could trade material, trade trade characters in, if you could go to material exchange and you could say, okay, I've got one bay leaf, I want to trade him for, trade him in for maybe not, not 250, but a reduced value, even if it's like 20% of the value, if you or 25% with your EXs, you could trade uh, like one of your EXs, a duplicate, and then get a thousand material. That would be fair for me. Um, I feel the reason they dropped the rates is because they were probably getting an influx of people, new new uh, people who get new downloads, and then all of a sudden it probably tailed off as people were coming into the game and not playing it because people had too much of an advantage. You know, my Zapdos would outbeat a lot of figures in the new new figures that have come out because of that 104 attack, and that's fair enough. But now I think we're getting to a point where it's it's actually. Yeah, 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 you, 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 kind of like failing the people who have stuck by the game and really enjoy it and want to play it for the future. So let's go through. T send, send your comments down below. What would you do to make the game better? What do you feel needs to change? And what I'm going to do is I'm going to collect all those responses, all the good ones, and I'm just going to create a video of changes. The community. What do we think? Uh, because I think it'd be really interesting to get your guys' ideas, and I bet you have some great ideas of how to make the game better, or just take it into the future. And who knows, they might check it out, Pokemon Company might just see it and and just think a little bit about what they're doing, and maybe make some changes that we could hopefully want and want to see in the future. So do that, drop a comment below stating what would you do, okay? Uh, obviously we've got no figures, so let's just, let's just, 
the 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 rant aside let's get into some gym play really enjoying it. like i say look at my squad i've got no new figures i'm ranked 383rd i haven't played many games to be honest i'm on 38 or 39 currently 39 i think so tomorrow is my last day so i'll hopefully do this today uh, i've been at work today so it's been hard to play so tomorrow i've got the whole day off i'll get my i'll get my my second for alligator for sure so we're running against a double vibrava squad which vibrava really really like my deck kills vibrava because i have zapdos um and greninja greninja just wrecks vibrava especially with the mana on so you start you instantly beating mudshot and you've got a good chance against dragon breath which rarely comes up supersonic it's, it's huge cover and you've got uh also aqua jet with empoleon so this should be a relatively easy squad to dispatch hopefully if i can get an early verizian swap against one of those magic arts as well take one out that would be just good if this guy ever plays I don't know how it is for you guys, but it is boiling in the UK right now. Like, hot. Seriously hot. Orange juice. Oh, so nice. Come on, Leonid. Here we go. He's ready. Oh, and it was a monster win. That's right, guys. That's how you win. You roll up. You put your Greninja forward with the 46 attack into these things. No. Nope. I'm not doesn't dare face me oh, <laughs> such a cheap win 39 victories oh, that takes me to takes me to uh, four, 39 I was, I was, uh, I'm where I thought I was anyway and this common booster oh yes we're going to get an EX from this for sure uh, they've dropped it definitely I mean the amount of commons I've pulled oh we pulled an uncommon Arbok yes yes no for the hundredth time uh I don't want to wait. I haven't, I haven't got any gems to boost up. <laughs> I think we're going to have to call it a day. By the way, if you're thinking, why is my um, why is my rating so low? Uh, it's because I've been playing so many other games recently. Uh, you know, Brawl Stars, Angry Birds Evolution, and playing in the gym. I, I just, I just haven't had the time to be able to play every game. So I've just been forfeiting bug bar and obviously just to get my lot of boosters and the daily missions. Um, and then, you know, sometimes I'll just, I, I, I once overnight left my game with no boosters running. Like for the first time in, in like three months, because I just actually thought, I'm not gonna get anything from the booster anyway. So I'm still enjoying playing with that, playing in the league, but I just don't, I, I, they're, they're, the other games are taken away from me because uh, at the moment they're usually short games the Angry Birds Evolution I think that'll be completed pretty soon um, but I'll come back to the end of the week make sure we get that high enough to get some boosters to do some openings okay well I'm sorry for that I <laughs> thought it was going to be a really interesting match but it turns out the guy was seriously afraid of Greninja and just forfeit. To be fair, you might be forfeit but boy as well. Who knows? Okay. Well, like I say, this this video is only mainly for that booster opening, and I just wanted to get your thoughts on changes that you'd make. So whack it down in the, the comments below, and I'll do a video on all the best comments. Okay. It's all from me. Take care. See you soon.